Okay, for these books right here, um, we are going to call these books uh, Learning is Fun. There's kind of a, a section in the new catalog for the new titles that says Learning is Fun, and that's where most of these come from. So that's what we're going to call it. Um, but these are awesome, so let's just go into it. This is Lift the Flap Shapes. If you have some other Usborne books, you might have Lift the Flap Word Book or the Lift the Flap Colors. Those go along with this one. So this is just a new one that's been added to that series. Um, the pictures are super bright and fun, and the whole focus obviously is on shapes. So this page right here, you are uh, trying to find these shapes that are hidden under these flaps. So there's our semicircle. Um, these are great if if you've got like a kid who doesn't like sitting still and maybe paying attention. Um, you can use Usborne's books and especially the lift the flap ones because they're more engaging. They get kids interacting, so they're really great. Um, this one here, you are finding these little characters. So you can say, okay, who's hiding underneath the circle? And then they have to find the circle and there's the little mouse. So lots of fun to focus on shapes. Oh, I have to show you this page because I love it. This is changing shapes. So like over here, we have a semicircle. What is it gonna turn into when we open it? into a circle. There we go. Um, so lots of fun for that one. Really bright, colorful pictures. This is questions and answers about dinosaurs. Um, the original questions and answers book that came out maybe almost a year ago now, it is like still one of my very absolute favorites. And now they have a dinosaur version, which you cannot go wrong with that. We love dinosaurs at our house. Um, so I'm super excited about this one. Let me just show you again. It is a flat book. Here's kind of your content page. So you can see you're asking what, which, who, why, all those sort of questions. Just lots of random questions to ask about dinosaurs. And then your answers are underneath the flaps. Um, and just like these are great for inquisitive kids or just to get kids thinking. Oh, like this one. I would never have even thought of this question. Could dinosaurs swim? Yes, at least tracks show that some of them could. Like, I never think about dinosaur swimming. But so these are just a lot of fun, and kids can just spend forever looking through these and learning all sorts of different facts. So that's a really great one. Um, this next one here is Deadly Animals. Um, again, Usborne has more in this series, and I don't know if you can tell very well from the video. This is called a flex binding. So it's not paperback and it's not hardback. It's in between. Um, it's really a fantastic binding and very sturdy. So this one is called Deadly Animals and it just has a whole bunch of animals that are dangerous to humans. Um, shows what they can do. I know. I Hopefully people aren't like too squeamish when I'm showing you this book. Um, but it's really interesting. There's some of the pages, like they'll even show, oh, here it is right there. Um, like it'll show how your body is reacting when it's, you know, touched by certain things. So this is chemicals. So this is a jellyfish over here. So it's showing like what exactly happens to your body. Um, oh, and there's some of them are comics that are kind of tell you like some true story type things that have happened. So these are great, but I am loving this Dangerous Animal ones that's new for that series. Okay, um, this is a Lift the Flap General Knowledge. Again, sort of like the dinosaur and the regular questions and answers, just lots of really good things. Let me show you the different categories we've got here. So we have Living Things, Treasure Trove, True or False, Entertainment, When Did It Happen, and Science Lab. Oh, and the world. Um, so you can see those are kind of the different sections that are covered. You can just, you know, kids can just hop to the one they want to do or they can go through the whole book. But I love these because um, kids can really sit down and like spend hours opening these up and learning all sorts of stuff without knowing that they're actually like learning information. So that is one thing that I super love about Osborne. I have to show you this one. This is the when did it happen page. So you have this awesome little timeline of all these important things that happened in history and when that was. So lots of great fun. Okay, and this last one, I am so stoked about this. Maybe I'm a total nerd, but um, I, like you remember when you learned about clouds in school and I always wish that I could remember 
what the different clouds' names were, but I never can. So now I have this book that is going to tell me, and I'm thrilled about it. Um, so let me, I got to find the page. There we go. See, look, so this tells us like the different types of clouds and what they're called, uh, what levels in the sky that they're at. Um, this talks about water, how those are involved, sun and air. Again, these are like little flaps that you're going to lift open um, to see all sorts of different things. This one's talking about wind and how wind um, affects weather and what wind does. And again, all of these are flaps that open up. So this one I'm like super stoked about and just for me because I want to read it. <laughs> so there you go. That's another great one for some early learning stuff.